Dr. Brinkman, you've had a very long and successful naturopathic career. Can you please speak to some of the unique ways that you've used your naturopathic doctorate? I think the most important thing I learned in naturopathic school is to take a holistic view of what's going on and really seek the cause. And so I started studying communication so I could be more influential with my patients. And then I had a medical doctor who told me the symptom is a metaphor for what's going on. And if somebody has uterine bleeding, you should ask, if those were teardrops, what would you be crying about? Well, I had a patient had arthritis. She'd had it for 15 years. Nothing had worked. So I figured, what do I have to lose? I'll pry into her life, although I didn't pry, friends pry professionals probe. I find her husband works for the federal government. He's flying back and forth to Washington, D.C. each week. She's hated that job but never expressed it and wants to support him. When minor upsets would occur, she wouldn't deal with it. They only had two days a week together, so she would suppress that. He was supposed to take an early retirement. He decided against that, and of course, she suppressed that too. Now, if you suppress too much with somebody you care about, it builds up a barrier between the two of you. My entire prescription was to teach her some communication skills on how you share upset without the other person feeling attacked. She did this and 30 days later her symptoms were gone. And I got what's known in the medical business as a major case of trout mouth when you look like this. Next thing I know I'm counseling more and more people. My practice becomes all mind body medicine. Eventually it evolves into public practice doing seminars, keynote speeches and trainings on communication and life fulfillment. And uh, I saw patients for maybe seven years, but for the last 30 years, I've been a professional speaker. I've spoken in 48 states, 17 countries, and 4,000 programs. Uh, naturopathic medicine was the best decision I ever made. And uh, naturopathic attitude has served me in so many places in my life. It's not about seeing patients.